Okay. And my GoPro is acting up for some reason. It keeps kicking off, and I'll have to kick it, kick it back on. I dropped it the other day, and it hasn't been working right ever since. So pardon me if these interruptions. But anyway, uh, yesterday was my final day of my first year on the OMAD program. And I'm happy to say today I am at uh, 338 exactly 48 or excuse me exactly 40 pounds from where I started uh, a year ago at 378 and I'm excited about that I wanted to show you uh, I have uh, I've, I've lost a tremendous amount of gut uh, it was sticking way out here if you go back and look at my at my first video um, you'll see that uh, how bulged out my gut was and uh, it's not near as bad uh, today but uh, today I'm uh, gonna talk a little bit about that year journey as I said last week I uh, I went through food cravings the first two to three weeks severe uh, food withdrawals uh, cravings like crazy uh, but I made it through that uh, I stuck with it the best I can I had some cheat days this year um, not gonna lie uh, but I had uh, very very minimal exercise this past year I just wanted to see what one year on this OMED program with literally no exercise would do and I dropped 40 pounds just on the OMED program. The OMED program if you eat one meal a day it puts you on a daily 24 hour fast which helps. I'm drinking a half a gallon to a gallon of water every day a minimum of a half a gallon that helps. I've tried cutting out all carbohydrates as best I can um, you know yesterday I did have a baked potato uh, um, you know with some ham uh, but uh, rarely that will happen uh, trying to cut out all breads all sweet drinks all that kind of thing but if you haven't started on this journey please start it with me let's do this second year together as of today I'm going to start incorporating every single day some riding a stationary bicycle doing some free weights and doing some exercise starting to walk every day we have bad weather right now uh, we've got snow on the ground today it's supposed to be in the 40s tomorrow's supposed to be in the 50s so hopefully it'll melt all the snow off and I can get out and walk some but I wanted to just tell you how I've been I'm feeling great I, I've lost inches around my waist um, probably four inches at least minimum uh, maybe more um, but anyway if you haven't started this journey and you need to lose some weight consider the OMAD program one meal a day it won't hurt you it won't kill you you will feel better you will look better your clothes will fit better uh, everything will change for you this has been a one-year journey I didn't know if I could make it or not but I did I'm excited about going into this next year two-year journey uh, my goal <coughs> this past year was to lose a hundred pounds I didn't do that I didn't even make it halfway but 40 pounds is awesome for me at 71 years of age minimum with basically no exercise this past year minimal amount of walking I'm going to increase that this year and really get on the bandwagon and stick with this program and see what the second year will bring by incorporating more exercise and uh, bring that into my program and let you know how I do that so I'm going to do one week videos every Saturday this is Monday it's a holiday Martin Luther King Day 
and I waited to do today because, <coughs> excuse me, <coughs> like I said, this is the day one. I started a year ago, January 17th, and today is 2022, January 17th. So I'm starting my second year program on the OMAD uh, journey. This is not a diet. It hasn't been a diet. It's been a lifestyle change. It's going to continue to be a lifestyle change for me, and I'm going to continue to promote the program and uh, encourage you to get on board. Uh, you can have all the meat you want, all the protein, all the veggies, all the fruit you want, um, and uh, it, it, it'll work. The weight will come off. You won't see huge increases every week. You'll see a pound, two pounds to come off. You'll hit plateaus like I did, and you'll go up and you'll go down, you'll go up, you'll go down a few pounds, and then it'll just keep coming off and you'll maintain that weight. And uh, that's what's happened to me. <coughs> <coughs> I've kind of hit a plateau about every 10 pounds, and it's been hard for me to bust through that, but once I bust through that plateau and keep that uh, 10 pounds off, I go into the next 10 pounds, and uh, it seems like it's taken me, you know, uh, two to three months to drop that 10, that 10 pounds and to keep it off. And so, uh, stay with me. Stay with this journey. I'd love to hear your comments uh, to, to see how you're doing. Let me know. Um, let me know what's happening with you. And uh, let me know that you're going to start and start this thing with me. And let's do this together. Let's get healthy. Let's get fit. Let's get back on the program and stick with it. Uh, I will contact you next week with my week number one <clears throat> in my year two journey of this OMAD program. 338 today, <clears throat> down 40 pounds for year one on my old man program. I am excited. I am feeling good. I'm, I'm hopefully looking much better. Uh, I'm getting this gone. I've got a lot of weight hanging underneath my arms. I've, I've got a long way to go yet. Um, my goal is still 100 pounds and uh, I'm going to celebrate that one day. <clears throat> it may take me three years. But uh, this next year, my goal is to lose at least another 50 pounds and uh, see, see what happens, okay? I'm going to uh, keep you on the journey with me. Stay tuned for next week, week number two, uh, excuse me, week number one of my year number two program. And I'm hopefully that I'll be excited to share with you that I'm down some more pounds, okay? Uh, I love you for sticking with me. Thank you for all the encouragement. Um, get on the program. Get the weight gone. Get healthy. Look healthy. Be healthy, okay? This is Cal on a wing and a prayer. I love you. I appreciate you. I'll catch you next week. I'm out of here for now. Bye.